What is going on guys? Last night I made an update video on the roster. So basically I told you that Jcap and Amos were leaving Envious and being free agents because Crimp6 and Karma were coming aboard Envious. There's a long story behind that and I gave you a little insight on that. But here we go. What happened today will blow your mind. It's, it's crazy right now. So Formal from Envy, which is pretty much the guy that caused all this problem with Envious. Um, making uh, Jcap and Nameless leave basically is the problem. He posted, okay, so after much thought and talk with Hastro, the owner of Envious, I have decided to clear free agency. What? So now your other two guys have called free agency. Now you want out of Envious? That doesn't make any sense. So he did a longer tweet, and this is what he had to say. You can see it right here on the screen. He says, so I decided to declare free agency. Basically, yesterday was a train wreck. You got that right, Jack. Anyway, it was a mess of emotions that caused everybody to make rash decisions. He then said, if it wasn't for me, then everything would have been fine, and I'd still be with Envy. There you go again. Duh. So he talked about how gaming is professionalism and everything like that. Just some of his decisions and stuff. I'm not going to read the whole thing, but there it is. Uh, it's just crazy. Now, he's calling free agency. And apparently, Jcap and Nameless are coming back to Envious. So now it's going to be Jcap, Nameless, and Merc on Envious. And they're going to be looking for their fourth. Um, Formal, previously from Envious, the guy we were just talking about, has posted on Twitter that announcements will be coming out soon on where he will be going. Um, so we have no idea where that's going. So the... Um, Thought uh, or idea of J Cap and Nameless coming to Object Nation is no longer or phase, so that's out of the water. So now we don't know who Object Nation is going to pick up. We don't know who um, Envious is going to pick up. We'll just have to see. But Embos did give us a little bit of insight. He said hopefully sometime next week he'll have some announcements for us regarding his squad Object Nation. Hastro, again, the owner of Envious, posted on Twitter a long tweet about the Team Envious roster situation please read so basically this is what he had to say he said matt which is formal approached him wanting to team with crim six on the next game and crim had expressed his interest in teaming with karma that put merc and i in a tough position for both of us being longtime veterans and they've had to deal with this situation before the only thing that made this situation different said hastro was that they had won the last two major events with the squad they have now or they did have. He said, dinner last night, Nameless had suspicions that they were considering a change. He came to the table and flat out asked if this was the case. Instead of lying to his face, Mark told him the absolute truth. This led Anthony, which is Nameless, and Jcap being angry and for a good reason. He said, of course, they began immediately entertaining options and it led to leaking out on Twitter. This wasn't something we wanted to happen before the tournament was over because their term, they have a tournament, ESWC or whatever it is in Paris which is over now, but it was still going on last night. They still had a team together. Um, so basically that came up with a snowball effect. A whole bunch of different things happened. You guys saw that on Twitter. You saw it in my previous video. But basically now he's saying, however, I'm here to say that we would not be parting ways with Nameless and Jcap. I took the appropriate time to think about the situation instead of being forced to make one immediately. But in the same sense, he should not have made those tweets last night bashing Jcap and Nameless. And again, Jcap and Nameless should not have tweeted out what they tweeted out. Even though it was for good reason, Jcap had every right to be mad and he flat out told them. Um, so he said, I just could not allow myself to release Jordan and Anthony this way. I care about them too much and they don't deserve that. Which is true. They've been on that team for a while um, and they won championships together. They're a really good team together and stuff like that. So... Um, I don't see why they should have dropped him either. He then says, I hope all the NBS fans out there can respect this decision. Although we lose an amazing player, Formal, who gave us an incredible run, we'll preserve with what with whoever our new fourth is and do what we always do, try to win tournaments. We wish him the best of luck and hope he continues to have an amazing career. No one out there should hold anything against them. To Merc, Jcap, and Nameless. Love you guys. Time to get back to work. That was coming from Hastro. Um, so yeah, crazy... Uh, situation with Envious between last night and today. All these roster changes are just causing drama and 
causing chaos and um, ruining friendships, basically. Like somebody said last night, I think it was Parasite. It's getting personal now, um, and which it is if you read some of these tweets and stuff like that. But at the end of the day, it's a game. Uh, and you have, I mean, yeah, they are playing for money because that's their career. But at the end of the day, it is a game, um, and people shouldn't be so harsh and everything like that. I guess I don't know. Um, on another note, big congratulations to. Scumpy from Opti Gaming, he reached a million subscribers today, uh, so congrats to him. Um, I am one of his subscribers, so that's pretty cool. Um, I've been subscribed to him for a while since I started following esports. The first team I found was Opti Gaming, and I just stuck with them um, and followed everybody on there, and that's just my team. Um, so EG is still having problems. They're under contract. Aches, Crimson, Karma, and TP are still under contract with Evil Geniuses. And I'm not sure if it's 100% the owner of Evil Geniuses, but there was a tweet posted that people, that people were retweeting yesterday. He said that he was not releasing Arcod players' speculation over. Now, that came from somebody. Otters are neat. Um... We got a lot of favorites and retweets, so I'm not sure 100% if that's the guy that's in charge of Evil Geniuses, um, but we shall see. And Karma said, I just wish EG would contact me and tell me what is going on, because they are still under contract, and they don't know when the contract ends, or maybe they do, maybe they just want to try to get out of it, um, and it's not working out. I don't know what's going on with them, so yeah. That's all I got for you guys today. If many more roster changes come out, I'll be sure to make videos. Stay tuned, guys. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.